show. This is a horny looking little crowd in here. <laughs> y'all think I can't see y'all, but I know y'all ass is horny. And it ain't just me. Y'all know what I realized? Why the men, when they go behind the counter at the gas station, they be thinking they important and shit? Y'all notice that? Them niggas go behind the counter and they with the raps and they think they doing something because they selling them a little punk ass A for weed and shit. <laughs> and then you know the next week the nigga gonna be right there with you next week talking about here bring the nigga 20 cent back. <laughs> Broke ass. Selling all this bammer ass weed. Y'all um, still watching pornos? Y'all yeah. still watching? Yeah, they like, yes. Okay, that's what's up. So I'm single, I'm watching pornos, I got a lot of spare time and shit. And y'all know what I noticed? Is it's a shortage on good hand jobs. Did y'all realize that? Did y'all notice that when y'all was watching the pornos? Okay, well let me tell you, I'ma help y'all. And you know they cut them unemployment, so I've been trying to figure out ways to make me a little sad change and shit. So I Googled it, y'all. I Googled it. And it's three things that's gonna be the top side hustles for this year. Number one was selling stuff on Amazon. Number two was cancel your car insurance. And guess what number three was? Good ass hand jobs. <laughs> but let me tell you, you can't have them little hands. You know them little raccoon looking hands? Cause that shit don't look cute around the penis. You can't have them. And then you can't have them ashy ass looking hands neither. You know the ones where you put the Vaseline on and the Vaseline like, we did all we could do. What <laughs> the fuck? We can't help you, you gotta take it from here. Not them damn punching bag looking hands neither. All right, y'all want me to cut to the chase. Y'all want to know what the hands should look like? Mass. <laughs> Did a three-day trial. Shit was overwhelming. Hell of a, hell of a response, y'all. But I didn't have any help. So, I, you know, I thought I'd find me another side hustle. And uh, y'all still give me head? Nobody still give me head? Yeah. Okay. Where, what was the comedian? Wasn't that Frida? What was her name? Did she say she was giving head? Okay, because I wanted to ask her if she ever got one of them stubborn ass pubic hairs caught in her throat. She left. Shit. I want to know how did she get that shit down? Did she eat a piece of bread? Like, what did she do? Because the paramedics had to come and save me, y'all. Y'all know how he was talking about that gagging and shit? I wasn't even trying to do it, right? So let me tell you, this is what happened. So I'm face to face with the penis, you know. So I'm down there. I'm like, I'm going to treat my little friend or whatever, you know, because I ain't got a dude. So I was giving it to him, right? I'm working it out like, mm, 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 mm. He's like, ooh, yeah, I like it when you want it like that. I like it when you want it like that. And then I was like, mm, 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 mm. <coughs> I was like, whoa. <coughs> Yeah, I like when you gag on it and get freaky like that. And I was like, I can't breathe. <laughs> so after the paramedics left and shit, I had to get behind it. So I just was wondering what she did to get that pubic hair out of there so I wouldn't have to call 911 next time. Because that shit is kind of embarrassing, y'all. If you got to call the damn paramedics, she said, what? That wasn't embarrassing? Oh, she was in the bathroom. You said, ask her again. Because <laughs> you want to know. You like, ask her again. Pubic hair? Yeah, what, so what did you do? Because I was asking that question. I asked where you went. You went to the bathroom. Who? Oh, so the bread do work. Oh, oh she said, eat the bread. Okay, so that's just like if you get a little fish bone part in your shit. You gotta eat a little fish bone. That, yeah, so that's what, that's what I'm saying. That's what, how you get the fish bones down. So you gotta eat a little bread. Not the bread. Yeah, you gotta eat a little bread. Ladies, y'all panties and shit ain't gotta match. Them men don't give shits about no panties and bra matching, y'all. Facts. All these niggas want is a warm hole. Okay? They don't care if they get the front, the back, your ear. Them niggas just want something to stick a, a hole, basically. <laughs> a hole is all these niggas want. <laughs> an eye, not an eye cat, damn. damn. Okay, he don't want damn. you to see for shit, huh? I'm so cold. Okay. <laughs> damn, he, you got poked in the eye before? That's why you keep them glasses on, huh? <laughs> niggas around 
out here poking motherfuckers. Ah, some shit. Nah, I just don't do it no more. Oh, dang. No more. Well, that ain't no fun. <laughs> you gotta get you something out here now and then, I can't. <laughs> I, this is an open mic, y'all. I normally don't be pulling my phone out of shit, but I'm try, I be trying to use some new material. But looking at y'all, y'all be like, no, we want some funny shit. You ain't got time to be trying out no new shit today. Putin about to push the button. Putin about to push the button. Any of y'all taking iron pills? Yeah. That's who about to fart. Let me tell you. You say who? That's who you about to fart. Yeah. Hell, you can barely shit, sir. If you take an arm. That's why I was asking. I was going to push the button. Oh, you talking about poop. You know what? We're going to bring your ass up here. Because your ass is doing a lot of talking and shit from the sidelines, sir. I'm talking about Putin and I'm talking about iron and shit. <laughs> talking about Putin. I'm talking about iron. I just want you to know you have to drink a lot of fluids with that iron, don't you? Yeah. You said you was taking some Keisha. Girl, let me tell you. Fiber, too? But, fiber. fiber. I don't know if yeah. you can mix them, two. Fiber. Baby, I was shitting the other day. I almost split my ass. You hear me? I thought I was getting violated again. I was like, wait again. the motherfucking <laughs> minute. Y'all ever get violated? Ladies, y'all take it in the ass? Oh, no. oh, yeah. I could. That's why I was just saying, had they ever been violated? Cause, uh, let me tell you. My baby daddy, his ass just snuck me. I was drinking some damn 1800. Ooh, I'm sweating like a hostage up here, y'all. These damn lights. Ooh, shit. Motherfuckers need to be tanning my ass because I'm up here sweating like a motherfucker. I was just going to tell y'all about my baby daddy, his ass. You know how the niggas be lying time I make your ass get bigger and shit? <laughs> Why do y'all tell these lies? Oh, it works. No, that shit don't work. And I'm not trying it no more. My shit was sore as hell. I was on the toilet trying to shit. Uh-uh, I pass. I'll just take this little ass I got. Um, any, <laughs> I'll just keep this shit and keep on squatting. Any of y'all got any bikini wax during this pandemic, ladies? Y'all keep y'all shit trimmed up, manicured? Y'all y'all are or what? Y'all doing it y'all selves? Groupon? Oh, that's what I'm going to have to check out. Groupon, girl. So anyway, I go to get me one, right? Maybe I let my shit go for too long. It was a little out of control. So instead of using one strip, Chinese lady put two strips on, y'all. Not motherfucking one bitch put two. And at the same time, okay? And then she just yanked them motherfuckers off. Didn't warn me or nothing. So I'm like, damn, this bitch just snatched off one of my toes. And then she don't have the nerve to say, uh, what you gonna do about the how you ass? Uh, bitch, nothing. You just snatched off one of my camera toes. Now my shit is uneven and shit. You talking about what I'm gonna do about the hair on my ass? Not a motherfucking thing. Shit. Snatch it off. Okay, so anyway, I go home. I'm feeling a certain type of way, y'all. My little friend there. He like, April, hey, don't let that shit get to you. It ain't even that bad. So I said, you know what? I'm going to listen to this nigga. So I went to sleep, y'all. The nigga, he really care about me. Because let me tell y'all what he did for me. To make me feel special. He braided the hair for me, y'all. And let me tell you what he did. It lifted up my cheeks. So I was like, you know what? <laughs> this hair on the ass ain't that bad. <laughs> okay. And then I, well, who was that talking about they had to, uh, they lost a lot of weight? Oh, that was Frida again talking about she lost. I can relate to that girl because I couldn't, you know, really get to my stuff. So that's how I had went and got the bikini wax. But I was a little, you know, after them two strips and shit, I was like, I don't know if I'm going to go back, you know, because I might not have no more lips fucking with her. So I called myself going to hook my shit up myself. Y'all used Nair before? Oh my goodness, that shit don't work. It's like a perm for your Gucci hair. Cause the shit was looking like um what's that nigga name who had his hair slick? <laughs> my shit had baby hair. It didn't even it was just straight, you know, it looked like it had good hair and shit. I'm like, ain't this about a bitch? I couldn't even, you know, it didn't even come all the way off. It just looked like good hair with some bangs and shit. Looked like sad burns and shit. I'm like, ain't this about a bitch? <laughs> Ladies, don't y'all hate food as you get out the shower? You got a shit. Is that not the worst shit? You know what I'm saying? You just got your ass clean. You got, and don't be wearing a thong that day. 
You got to get your ass back in that shower, okay? Especially if it's one of these hot days. You wearing the thong, motherfucker ain't get all them angles and shit. Shit could work out pretty bad for you. It could be pretty bad. Um, and since it's getting warm, ladies, remind your girlfriends and let them know just because they took a shower the night before, they still got to freshen that hole up in the morning, okay? Because it's a warm hole. And a lot of you girl, y'all girlfriends is showing up to work and their vaginas have morning breath, ladies. Damn. Yeah, it do. Damn. And it's the type that greets you as soon as you come in. It do. It do. <laughs> Tony, Jim and I. Motherfucker sound like Wendy Williams when I walked in. Damn. I came in the other day, bitch vagina said, how you doing? <laughs> I said, did this bitch vagina just greet me? Damn. Bitch, it is too early for that. I got a hangover. And hot. Okay, and hot. Look at her voice. <laughs> what? <laughs> Shut up, oh, Gemini. Oh, there you go. Your ass done already been up here. Shit. Shut your ass up. Woo. <laughs> I asked y'all if y'all still give me head. Do y'all be trying to be creative when y'all get y'all do head? Yeah, you have a like roll up for the what? Oh, that's a good idea, girl. Oh, I love it. Oh my God, she said, look at him. Like, what she say? Oh, she said, put a fruit roll up on it. Oh my goodness, I'm going to try that. Because let me tell you what I did. I ate some peanuts and then sucked his penis. I said, oh, we're going to make it a payday. <laughs> we're going to make this penis a payday, okay? A uh, payday. That's <laughs> Yeah, I, I didn't know. I was drunk. You but said, I, was, I, was, I said, we was going to make it a payday. Oh. I ate the peanuts and forgot I ate the peanuts, Gemini. Dang, girl. Um, <laughs> but I didn't put none in the hole or nothing. It don't matter. <laughs> <laughs> I was just trying to be creative and freaky. You just said suck the dick whenever oh, you can. Yeah. So I had to forget I ate the peanuts. So I was like, well, let me give him some of this bob ass head. Damn. Pop rocks. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> oh my goodness! That, 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 I bet that is some shit right there, baby. I'm gonna make sure I'm taking mental notes of this freaky shit. There's some freaky ass shit going on over here. Okay. Wow. Oh shit, y'all. I'm so sorry. My damn phone going off. I found myself trying to time myself. Um. <laughs> this nigga, he, you know what? Okay, <laughs> okay, they got it. Oh shit! I'm gonna have to uh, Will Smith his ass come off the stage and smack the shit out of his ass. Like nigga, stop fucking with my set, okay? I'm already sweating my motherfucking panda, my door to explore out and shit. <laughs> Then sweated my shit out. It was already halfway sweaty. Now I done sweated the rest of this motherfucker out. Yep, I look like a mature door to explore. I know I do. Um, let me see. I want to tell y'all a few other love of some new shit. Like I was saying, I don't never get to the new shit because I'll be trying to be funny. Um Sheesh. Ah, oh, dang, y'all. I can't even. Oh, I realized. When I'm on my menstruation, I don't shave my underarms. <laughs> uh, <laughs> ain't nobody gonna be getting none, so why the fuck I gotta be all doing all this extra shit for these niggas? I'm sick of this shit. We got too much shit to do for these niggas. And they don't appreciate it, do they? We go through all this shit and y'all don't appreciate it. Y'all lying asses, lie about unnecessary shit too. They bring you a, un, a, a voluntary lie, won't they, ladies? Oh yeah, boo, I got a doctor's appointment tomorrow. <laughs> Girl, the nigga had a stroke the next day. <laughs> Bitch, I thought you went to the doctor. Just an unnecessary ass lie. They just lie just to be lying. <laughs> and you do you do get up here and be like, dang, I wish I would have remembered that joke because I didn't want to use my phone, but um. I'm looking at it and I still don't even see the damn new joke I wanted to tell y'all. So, uh, I guess I'm going to get ready to wrap it up. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> um, 
It's some hell of a booties out coming out this year. Woo. Be on the lookout. We got some strong booties, some uncertain booties. We got some EBT booties. And we got some booties that look like punching bags. Y'all seen them booties? Oh yeah, they the ones where it's like a roll up here that is long with a little hang time on the motherfucker. <laughs> Looking like Tony was punch punching on that motherfucker like, Tony! <laughs> These asses is getting out of control. They're getting out of control, y'all. Um, that's about it. I guess I ain't gonna hold y'all. Y'all can probably still get a couple of little barbecue sandwiches and shit. When y'all get up out of here. Oh yeah, y'all can still hit the store. Um, oh, I think, I'm gonna tell y'all this and I'm gonna get out of here. I'm back to selling uh, coochie and stamps. Okay. So uh, follow me on Instagram. My name is a Hollywood 37 Y'all have been a wonderful crowd. Thank y'all so much.